Well, this is my little bit synth. Uh, it's a Korg that I got from a uh, musician's friend. Here comes with a manual. Basic introduction to synthesizer stuff. And then it describes the various parts. And uh, it shows some uh, suggested uh, ways you can patch these together. They work magnetically. Uh, they attach together. Shoot, if I can get this up on. Um, by one piece hooking onto the other piece. Now, see, that one's the opposite way, so there we go. And uh, you line them all up to create a synthesizer. It comes with uh, um, two oscillators, one keyboard, has a power supply, it has a, uh, has a sequencer, four stage sequencer, and uh, attack decay, uh, mixer, and, uh, and splitter, so that you can, uh, you can basically uh, create like two lines of synthesizers, which is really cool. Another oscillator. This is uh, the delay, which is kind of neat. It's got that built into it. A randomizer. And uh, this is a filter. It's an envelope filter, and it has cutoff and peak. And it has a nice little speaker here. It actually sounds not too bad that it hooks all up, hooks all up to. So basically, that's, that's the basic. But you get one thing. Uh, I didn't label these boxes as to what goes in them, so I, I can't quite get them back the way they were. Oh, well. Okay, I've got this set up now. I've got a sequencer here. I've got a keyboard here. I don't really notice a whole lot of results difference with the keyboard. And I've got two oscillators, frequency modulation. But this one turned down fairly low, so it's more of a LFO kind of thing. And uh, there's a, that's on a square wave. These things are a little kind of difficult to change, but now that's square wave. And I got this one on sawtooth wave. Yeah, I don't know much keyboard. But anyway, I'm planning, I'm thinking of getting another one of these, and uh, these things are so cool to play with. Okay, I've readjusted, I took out the randomizer, and I've got the keyboard and the oscillator. And uh, I found over here, I didn't notice this, you can change the octave. And you can also change whether you just press the keys or whether it holds. These little things are kind of bothersome. Now I still got this in a square wave oscillator. This one over here. Now I'm trying to wave. Now, as you can see, I press this key down here, I press this one. It's, uh, I forget what it's called. In synthesizers, it's uh, it either it can either go with this the second key or the first key. Oops, I got the volume off now. Um, anyway, cool, very cool. Okay, now I've got my uh, little bits hooked up with uh, everything, all all in the box, and it comes with a handy book. Just familiarize yourself with this stuff. The only thing is, I thought like only one filter to work with and have to do this all with one hand. Uh, so anyway, to start with, I got a sequencer over here. I got a random randomizer here, an oscillator here, and this is delay. If I can get that. Make sure that your fingers are fanned out wide. So this is just a Yeah, I had the uh, too low. So you're hearing both of these. And I've got my filter here, attack decay here, keyboard here. So, it's pretty obvious. We get some pretty complicated sounds out of this. But what I really need to do is buy another kit. Because I need, I want, I want to have a complete synthesizer on each of these lines. And for, unfortunately, it goes into a mixer like this with, with one output. So, yeah, I don't know. I can't find anything in here, but apparently it's a mono out. I can't find the details yet. But, um, yeah, you can do some really awesomely cool stuff. And you have a, a pro kit where, um, that you can have a, a, a MIDI and control voltage and, and some other stuff. So MIDI would be really great, but this keyboard is, you know, it's pretty freaking limited. So anyway, that's it going with the works. Well, I, I've readjusted this. And, uh, you know, the filter has to be adjusted right. It peaks out too high. Um, and, uh, it's a delay kind of here, but you got to get it just right, or, or you don't get the full effect of those. 
I, and I got both of my cats kind of curious about what's going on with this thing. But I really love the sound that you get. It's really complex and interesting sounds. And, uh, you know, I need a... There's a there's another kit with, with that has, like, MIDI and all, and I need to get that. But I don't think it just... I may buy another one of these uh, to work with because I, I, I really think this is so cool. 